What is up ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeff Benjamin with iDownload Blog. I'm gonna show you something really, really cool here and this involves the Touch ID sensor on the iPhone 5S. Yes indeed, a Touch ID tweak I'm gonna show you right now. This is the updated version of AppLocker. Now if you know about AppLocker, it basically allows you to lock apps on an individual basis like this and you have to enter a password in order to unlock the app. So I've set a password for this application or just universally as test, that is the password, and that allows me to unlock the applications that I have locked. But if you have an iPhone 5S, yes indeed, you figured it out already, you can use the Touch ID sensor with your Touch ID registered fingerprints to unlock those apps. So I'm gonna tap on App Store, it's gonna put my finger on Touch ID like that, and bam, it is unlocked just like that, no passwords required. So you have to have the registered Touch ID fingers, uh, you have to use the fingers that are registered within Touch ID, otherwise it will not work. So I'm gonna show you right now, I'm gonna use my uh, pinky finger here and try to unlock this and nothing's happening. I'm gonna try to use the other finger, nothing's happening. I'm gonna try to use the middle finger, nothing's happening. The index finger is registered, and unlocks just like that, folks. So that is AppLocker, the new iOS 7 approved, ARM64 approved AppLocker that allows you to unlock your applications that you have locked using the tweak with your fingers. Super simple, super easy. Now when you go into the settings panel, at least on this beta version of AppLocker, you can't use your finger just yet. It is still in development, it's still being worked on, and frankly, who knows how many other cool things are gonna be included with this, but even if it just stopped right there, uh, that is enough for me. Just being able to lock your apps on an app-by-app -app basis and secure them with your Touch ID fingerprints. So nice to have. It is called App Locker. It is currently in development. It will be available in the near future. So stay tuned and let me know what you think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownload Blog.